let us solve question number 106 guys so what we have identify the correct statement from the following okay before going to the options just look at the statement guys okay so what are the statements co2 is used as a refrigerant for ice cream and frozen food is this statement correct most of you will say that it, the statement is correct but the twist in the tail guys over here is what look over here guys co2 gas they have mentioned what we are using as a refrigerant for ice cream and frozen food we are using dry ice that is solid co2 guys so the first statement over here is wrong okay second statement the structure of c60 contains 12 6 carbon rings and 20 5 carbon rings is this statement correct i don't think so because this is 20 so this should be how much this should be 12 this is 12 this should be 20 guys right so the second statement is also not correct let us look at the third and the fourth statement zsm5 a type of zeolite is used to convert alcohol into gasoline is this statement correct yes it is correct okay the last statement carbon monoxide is colorless and odorless gas yes carbon monoxide is a colorless gas and also it doesn't have any specific odor that's why this statement is also correct so let us look at the options that are available to us a and c only no b and c only no c and d yes guys c and d is correct so the correct answer is option three guys i hope you have understood this i'll say it was a factual question you should be a little careful because they have mentioned what co2 gas let us move on to the next question let us start with question number 107 what we have here let's see the correct option for free expansion of an ideal gas under adiabatic condition is okay so let us first do the analysis of the question guys and then look at the options when i'm saying free expansion what do i know about free expansion work done will be zero right when i'm saying adiabatic conditions what do i know about this q is equal to zero okay so i've already got two things that is w is equal to zero and q is equal to zero let us look at the options now q is equal to zero del t less than zero and w greater than zero q is less than zero del t is equal to zero w is equal to zero q is greater than zero del t is greater than zero and w is greater than zero so where do these things fit guys it fits under what it fits in option four so the answer is option four guys okay is this clear guys if you want to find out about del t if q is zero w is zero then del u will also be zero right so if del u is zero then del t will also be zero guys okay so let us move on to the next question that is question number 108 okay which of the following oxo acids of sulfur has oo linkage that is we are talking about peroxide linkage okay h2so4 that is sulfuric acid what is the structure of sulfuric acid sulfuric acid is h o s double bond o double bond o and oh okay so it doesn't have a peroxide linkage h2s2o8 it is already written over there guys it is per oxo what it is per oxo disulfuric acid if i draw the structure of the second option what we have h o s double bond o double bond o o o and oh do i see a per oxo linkage over here yeah per oxide linkage over here yes so the answer is option two guys okay i hope you have understood this a very simple question guys just it's a fact you just have to show it okay let us move on to the next question